This is Dean with People Creative, and we've got the 2024 Slingshot Slingwing V4. All right, so the wing is out of the bag, and this is the 3.5. It pumps up to 10 psi. So that leading edge is very stiff. Um, as stiff as anything else I've seen out there on the market. But overall, you can see this wing is a good looking wing. Um, completely different from V1, 2, and 3. Um, the canopy tension, as you will see, is. You can see it's taken from the javelin wings. I like the javelins because of that canopy tension. And they've basically taken that tension, they've added the window. As you run your hand over it, you can really feel that tension towards the leading edge right there. And then towards the treading edge, it starts to loosen up and you'll, you'll see next. It's the tension right to the tip. And as you run your hand to the left towards the trailing edge, it starts to loosen up. It's very similar to a windsurfing cell where you used to rig up your cell and and put on the downhaul and kind of loosen up that trailing edge or, or the leech on a cell. And you can see the shape and um, the design that's gone into this wing is, is completely different from anything else. The leading edge shape is different. The stiffness is different. The canopy tension is different. That center strut, I call it the pencil tip. It's narrow, so it it creates um, when you when you sheet in with your back hand, it creates that power when you sheet in and you're pumping the wing. And on the 5.5 wings and bigger, it will pump up to eight psi. The handles uh, they just click in, and I will show you next kind of how that works. The tips on that leading edge are, are a smaller diameter than the V3. And this is how you disconnect the handle. You just press down the tab and then you just pull the handle out. And uh, I strongly advise do not put get sand inside that, that clip. It will not be fun. So let's take it out in the water and take it for a spin. The uh, first two or three sessions, uh, it was windy enough here in Florida to use the 4.5. V4 and I'm using uh, the Windcraft V2 80 liter board, the PTM 899 front wing with the 360 V stab. I have been using um, all of the sling wings V1, 2, 3, and now the 4 and uh, when I jumped on the V4, I could feel the best word to describe it was the balance, smooth, but it had that tractor pull. And so I think, you know, I'm around about 88, 89 kilograms, which is 192 to 194 pound. And um, I, can, I think I can use a smaller wing because the power is there, but it, it's not, because the canopy tension is different, it pulls you forward, not kind of down, sort of downwind. So the canopy, the, uh, canopy tension is, is a huge difference. You can see on the 6.5, there's like a camber on the leading edge, deep pocket stability in, in the middle of that wing. And then if you do hit a gust, you'll see that trading edge just kind of loosen up on on you and right here I'm actually going through a very glassy section hardly any power and you can see that um, I'm just I just keep gliding I just keep moving along here are some uh, highlights from today's video of the wing I think overall uh, I am super stoked with the sling wing v4 the slingshot team done a fantastic job really putting together putting the pieces together of everything from from the rigid more frame the canopy 
the handling, the smoothness, the power. It's a great all-rounder and I am really looking forward to testing this wing even more, taking it out in the surf and uh, hopefully we'll get some stronger wind soon so I can get out there on the 3.5 and um, if you like this video please subscribe, like, share it with your friends and then until the next time I'll see you on the water. Thanks for watching.